so that minor level at 98 worked out like a charm. I marketed in at 98.50 and I'm riding this up. I took some profit already at, at 03, 03 area. Uh, now I'd like to see it pull up to the 14 area, but we'll, it has to stay above this 04 because it's a main support for me to be trailing it all the way up. We'll see what happens. Okay, go ahead. I'm trailing the, the nice. final. Yeah. No, yeah, that's that's the area of support. I got 99, 25, 98, somewhere around there. That's that's a good area of major support right under that level. Obviously, mm -hmm. those 90s and 86, 75. So mm -hmm. if, if the fade is what you guys are looking for, then that is going to be the bounce off that level. Um, if you're not comfortable with that, you can let the market try to break up above the 08s and then try to pull back and retest to make a lower high. And then try to go from there if that's what you guys want to do to make it move up. Um, as far as resistances are concerned, I'd say 0875 is definitely my first area of resistance. Above that, I'm going to probably pull it somewhere around this little slight area right here. I'm going to see what the market does right around this area right here. One and two. Um, right around this area for me is what I'm going to look for the market to see how the reaction happens um, above that though you got a major level of resistance sitting right above these 32 so we'll see is that gold you're talking about buddy no S&P oh okay yeah that's just the bigger levels for me oh okay yeah there's probably going to be some minor levels um, but I don't like, I don't want to mess, especially in this downtrend. If I'm going to try to fade it back up, I don't want to mess with the minor levels. Yeah. I'd rather, I'd rather hit the, if I'm, if I'm going to um, do anything, I'd rather hit it off the major levels, whether I'm going long or short, I'd rather do that. Okay. Well, I'm still in my uh, long down at the market order at 08 area. Cause I think it's going to pull up to the 14. Um, I like that too. That's yeah. exactly what it looks like. It's strong bullish from that major level of support. Right. So that's the low of the bottom, like right there where I marked, that's the low of the bottom that I'm looking to see the reaction first. Mm -hmm. And if yeah. not that level, then right above that, somewhere around these twenties is my next area of interest. But you can see how strong that minor level at 98 was. Um, okay. First you have one wick candle green, then you have a couple of rejections. I'm looking at the ATIC. And then you have uh, a close <clears throat> of another strong bullish wick candle, which is why I marketed it in there because I knew it was going to go up at least to the 04 area. And then when you trail it, if it likes to hold that 04, which is a main support, then it's going to go back up and retest the support at, at the uh, 14 area.